thousands of dollars gone in a matter of minutes after a truck pulls up and steals a trailer filled with an Austin band's gear. Now they're hoping video from the theft can reunite them with their instruments. But as Nabil Ramadna shows us, this isn't the first band to have issues like this. Some of the best songs are written, written when, you know, when you're sad or you know, when you have something to say. Crowbot guitarist Chris yeah, Bishop makes least, music yeah. for a living. But at the moment, his days playing in front of packed venues have come to a halt. The trailer was here, and yeah, they just they came and uh, cut the lock and just attached it to their truck and left. Video from one of his North Austin neighbors shows a red single cab truck pull up to the trailer. Then once it's attached, they drive off. Inside the trailer, $30,000 worth of equipment, including instruments, sound equipment, and much more. I was in shock. I was you know, ghost white. My wife thought I was going to throw up. Bishop says it happens more often than you might think. There are way too many names of people that have got their trailer stolen to name them all. The Drew Fish Band also had their trailer stolen, and they also had someone break into their trailer and steal gear. That's why they upped their security. I mean, we have a GPS transmitter in ours, so that if it gets stolen, we know where it is. It's really messed up our probability of touring in the immediate future. Bishop says he's hoping someone will call police with some info, but until then, he's looking for that truck in the video. Just know that I'm out there every day, and I'm looking for that truck. Nabil Ramadna, KXAN News. And the same night the Crowbots trailer was stolen, King's X, another Austin band, had their trailer broken into and merchandise was stolen. Crowbot has set up a GoFundMe. They say because of the theft, though, they don't know when they're going to be able to play or go on tour next.